Hello and welcome to the Quick Schools Admissions Module Quick Guide. In this video, we'll be showing you how to activate and configure the admissions module, manage inquiries and applications from prospective students and families, convert interested inquiries into applications, how to enroll the applicant into the school roster, and we'll also show you how to create custom status codes to control the flow of your school's admissions process. To get started, let's go to the Features page and activate and configure the admissions module. Check the checkbox in the Admissions row to activate the feature, and then click Configure to set it up. Type in or select the users you want to grant access to manage admissions. Then select who can run reports. When finished, click Save. Now let's go to the Admissions page by clicking the tab in the top menu. The Admissions module is a simple and convenient way to record and track potential students from their first inquiry to enrollment. Let's walk through the natural progression of entering a potential student into the system. When an interest in attending your institution arises, you can enter it into the Inquiry section of the Admissions module. Simply click Add Student Inquiry to create a record. Fill in the inquirer's name and any other additional information. Then enter the student's name as well as their personal information. You can also specify what grade level the student will be applying for or coming into. The Inquiry status is a simple drop-down menu that tells you the status of this inquiry. In the drop-down menu, you can choose from a number of different codes to classify the status of your inquiry. Since no decision has been made yet about this inquiry, let's select the status in progress. Click Save to record your progress and submit your inquiry. Once an inquiry is in the system, you can track all the interactions you've had with this inquirer by logging them into this comment section. The system also displays an automated history of all actions taken for this inquiry by you and any other users you have granted access to manage admissions records. Once the inquirer is interested in applying to your institution, change their status to Converted to Application and click Save and Close. Quick Schools will automatically open and create a new student application with the information from your inquiry transferred over to the new form. Feel free to fill in any additional information fields. The application status can be tracked by simply updating the drop-down menu to any of the following statuses. If an application is approved and accepted, then the final step is to set the status to Enrolled and click Save. Confirm the enrollment semester and grade for the student by clicking Confirm. The application will disappear from your applications table and a new student record is added to your institution's student list with all their information automatically transferred over. Note that you don't have to start every application with an inquiry. You can create applications on the fly by simply clicking Add Student Application and following the previous steps. Quick Schools also allows you to create custom statuses to accommodate the unique workflow of your school. You can enter in as many custom workflow statuses as you want for both inquiries as well as applications. Let's create a new application status now as an example. Click the Add Status Code button and type in the name of your new status code, then click OK. Your new status code is added to the list and can now be selected in the Application Status drop-down menu of your applications. Note that even though the process to create custom status codes is the same for both inquiries and applications, you must create individual codes for use in each of the sections. We hope you enjoyed this chapter of our quick guide. If you have any questions or concerns, please contact us by either using the live chat bubble in the bottom right of your screen or emailing us at support at quickschools.com.